We now return to Vetter Call Saul. Hey, Saul, got into a little trouble and I'm gonna need a lawyer. Hey, yeah. Okay, so tell me exactly what happened. I was driving, had a bit to drink, and then I ran into a milk truck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Were you on drugs? Ian Bloho. Turn that off. I'm mad at TV. Peter, what's wrong? Family Guy has been around since 1999, and whenever it's time for the Emmys, they don't give us one. I'm sick of it. Well, I'm not making another episode with The Simpsons. What did that get us? I'll tell you what it got us. More ink for The Simpsons. Yeah, Simpsons plays down to competition. Simpsons step into the sewer. Shame on you, Simpsons. Those lucky bastards. Well, this week, we do classy comedy. Emmy comedy. I think that's a great idea. It's about time we made some quality television, like Modern Family, Girls, and Transparent. That's the spirit. Griffins, let's make this our Emmy-winning episode. So get all your pukes and farts out now. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I mean, not funny. Kids, it's me, tu madre, Lois Griffin. Time for breakfast. Oh, yeah. Good morning, Lois, which is who you are. My wife, Lois. Hugging my wife. Package for Peter Griffin. Thank you, unknown delivery woman. Forget the freaking Emmy. If you touch her ass, I will... <gasps> Amazon. Ay, my uncle Alejandro lives in the Amazon. Do you think he has sent us shoes made from banana leaves? Boy, the, uh, the ethnic characters on these Emmy-winning shows aren't exactly rocket scientists, are they? I don't know what you're talking about, Liz Lemon. No, this is something I ordered. For me. I am a woman, and always have been. I've made plans to undergo surgery so my wang don't get in the way of the woman what I am. Ay, Dios mío! Lois, I'll still be a parent to our children. But now I'll be a transparent. Get it? Transparent? Clever pun, right? Please honor me for my courage. I think gender reassignment surgery is very brave, and the fat man should win some kind of award for it. The fat woman. He hasn't chopped it off yet. That doesn't matter. Peter already identifies as a woman. And on karaoke night, I identify as George Michael. That doesn't mean it's true. Brian's just mad because he has to be the lady one. Which makes you the one who's gay in real life. Daddies, I'm standing here delivering my line with more emotion and less of a monotone than the actual Lily on Modern Family. I'm now confident enough to share my truth with the rest of my loved ones, beginning with my son, Chris. Bazinga, father. Assuming father is still the appropriate designation. What, what are you doing? Waiting for the laugh to die down. I'm here because I've decided to become the woman I am inside. Can you find it in your heart to accept me? Oh, Dad, science has moved so far past binary gender construction, and if being a woman makes you happy, then in the words of Mr. Spock, it's only logical. Wow, I couldn't follow any of that. But look how smart your audience is. 